We all have eaten food, but we need to start thinking and talking about it too, because the future of food is one of the biggest challenges on our plate. Food and drink are more central to our lives than we might think, since they connect everything from our health to the world around us. Let's take our friends the bees. Everybody knows they're famously busy, but did you know that by transferring pollen between plants, bees help create around a third of the food we eat? Thanks to the bees, we're able to make tasty, nutritious meals like this one. For pollination to work, bees need to get from A to B and back again safely. But lots of things are happening in the world that affect their journey. For instance, the world's population is growing so quickly that farmers need to produce more food to feed everyone. But it's hard for them to grow all that food when pesky pests keep eating their crops, so they sometimes spray them with pesticides. This is bad news for the bees, as pesticides harm and confuse them, meaning they struggle to find pollen and can't find their way back home. That's one of the reasons why there are fewer bees in the world. And remember, fewer bees means less pollination, which means less delicious fruit, veg, seeds and nuts. But that's not all we need to think about. Sometimes fertilizers are used to help crops grow bigger and quicker. But that's troublesome too, because they get washed into rivers and pollute our water. And believe it or not, water is precious these days. Especially as it takes about 15,000 litres of it to make just one kilogram of beef. So there might not be any meat in that sandwich either. Hmm. In fact, loads of other things like climate change, food demand and changes to how we live affect our health and the way we eat. And they're all connected. In a nutshell, we all need to take a fresh look at our relationship with food because at the moment it's unsustainable. It's crunch time. That means it's time for The Crunch. The Crunch is an exciting year of activities, experiences and discussions about our food, our health and our planet. We'll be getting our teeth into a range of topics, such as where our food comes from, what we'll be eating in the future and what a healthy and sustainable food system might look like, which will be great for the bees, plus anyone who cares about our planet and that's why everyone's invited. Whether you're a student, teacher, parent, researcher, or someone who's interested in food, you can get involved and be part of creating the recipe for a happier, healthier future. The Crunch is a real melting pot. From experiments in schools to family activities, fun interactive stuff online, and free events all over the UK. You can even become an ambassador for The Crunch. Sounds tasty, doesn't it? Find out more by signing up on social media or exploring our website. It really is crunch time, so if you love food and you care about our health and our planet, get involved in the crunch. <laughs>